Is that scatter book or what? What the frick is that? Ew! What's up guys, it's Tyranitar2 and welcome back to Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. In the last episode, we met Karida and all that stuff. Guys, shank that like button. 4k likes, we upload this again. I think I can manage again today i think i can manage three episodes today maybe four but we'll rinse and repeat tomorrow so uh shank like let's go in now we gotta climb the lighthouse and uh meet nemona at the top we have cried on technically in our party look at this look at this we have a the seventh slot cried on i just have to move my face cam if we go into battle but uh we'll see we'll see okay because i like i like where it is right now uh nemona nemona where the frick are you nemona did you just Okay, I thought I'm... <laughs> okay. Look, Damo. That's Mesagoza. Okay, this is the main school city. Wow, wow. We have to freaking... And that's you. Why the frick did Clavo come then? <laughs> that's my daddy. I'm unfortunately saying that. And that huge building with the Pokeball on it is our school. Wow. The freaking mountains. It's going to be so great having you in the same class, Damo. But all that schoolwork. <laughs> She's thinking about it too. <laughs> Don't think of it as school work. Think of it as tons of chances to learn about Pokemon battling. Isn't it awesome that what you can see from up here? Mountains, forests, grasslands, beautiful nature, stuff as far as the eye can see. That's true. And you know what's waiting for you all over those natural spaces? Tons of Pokemon. Already we've seen a bunch of new Pokemon. Well, have we seen a bunch? Consider this me officially telling you, welcome to Paulia. Thanks, Gita daughter. But anyway, like you can see, it's kind of a hike to get to school from here. Wow, there's a whole town before the Los Plantos with a gas station Pokemon. Vamos, come on. Okay, let's go. Freaking, um, it's about almost 3 a.m. now. I, <laughs> I'm sad, but I feel like I have to, after I record, I have to freaking go to sleep. I'm, where am I? How am I supposed to sleep? This game has been so sick so far. Go back up. Um, okay, so we have to, can I not call Koridon? This is a bit of a walk, you know. Look at that, just picking up freaking, okay, that's a trainer right there. You stupid? You stupid, just existing like that. Hey, let's battle. If you talk to a Pokemon Chain like me, it means we're gonna battle. How dare you? You're supposed to say if our eyes meet. Did the freaking overworld theme just transition? I might be tripping. Hey! Don't you send this out on... This thing is disgusting. They made a thread to... Wow. That's a pretty good level. They made a thread tarantula Pokemon. That's pretty good. I wonder what it could evolve into. They already have the creepy looking spiders. What else could they give us? Also, he has the Tauros on his shirt. That's one thing we saw. We saw a Tauros. We saw a parrot. We saw a freaking Psyduck. We saw um, that Pokemon we just saw. What is it called? Torantola or something. Uh, what is this? Look at this. I could... Oh my goodness. I did not think I'd be allowed to come here. This is amazing. Goodness, going back to like freaking Pokemon uh, Fire and Leaf Green and thinking about how little you can actually explore everything. Y'all buddies? It's crazy. This game is like a fully explorable. Like you could sink so many- I freaking wish I could ride Koridon. I gotta walk all the way back. So to leave me alone, you're not new. What the- I didn't even- the frick is your problem? Get your boy band off my face. Okay, I was listening to the music. I feel like sometimes it might trans. Oh, the Wigglets have arrived. You fricks. You dirty, dirty. What happened? Where did my Foy Coco go? What the hell is that in the water? Is that a Phoebus? Oh my god. <laughs> Look, the Buizel swimming? This is what you get when, like, there's no wild encounters. There's no random encounters. That means the overall, every route's gonna have, like, showing Pokemon in their natural habitats. Now that I think of it, it might be a proper upgrade to sacrifice random encounters for that. I will miss it, but we'll, we'll give it a fair, 
uh, judgment after this game. Because, uh, like, at least in Pokemon Sword and, and in Legends, I freaking, <laughs> I freaking love getting chased by Pokemon. It was so fun. It's terrifying in the moment, but I, I love looking back at the footage. Um, look at this water refraction. What the frick is- <laughs> what the frick is going on? Uh, okay. I'm level 9 now. Palmy can evolve in the back of my party. Wiglet I might actually use. I'm curious if it evolves. Garden eel. Oh, goodness. It's not even a Diglett, man. This po- like, that's so creepy. This Pokemon can pick up the scent of a Veluza. Is that a freaking Pokemon? Just over 65 feet away. It will hide itself in the stand. I'm gonna call you... Um, oh my god, it's a girl. I'm gonna call you Wanda. How do you spell Wanda? Wanda? Why the frick would I name it Wanda? <laughs> what the frick? Yo. <laughs> a Wanda? All that comes to mind is freaking Fairly Out Parents. This does not remind me of... Oh, I thought they were juggling the freaking Magikarp. What is that? What is that abomination? Oh my goodness, what the frick is that? It's a... <laughs> it's a Wingo! Look like a tiny car! No way. No freaking way. Um... Uh, oh shoot, man. Like, you could... I could walk in the water a bit here, but... What the frick? Oh! I guess I can! I died! But, you know, soon I'll be able to swim, I'll be able to climb these cliffs. I'll be able to come back to the starting routes and, like, see many more... You just... You gotta stop sitting on the buizos, man. Uh, like, I wonder if the Pokemon will be, like, higher leveled up there and everything, too. Okay, so we gotta, we gotta trek to school. We gotta go to school. So, the, the teachers, we have, like, five teachers, and they all have, like, proper designs. Think about it. To be teaching at a school about Pokemon battling, you have to be, like, you have to be a strong trainer. Will I die if I go in that water? I don't think so. Like, I wonder if some of them are... You freaking blocking... I wonder if some of them might be gym leaders. Maybe the Elite Four equivalent? You never really know. It would sound right that, like... What's gonna happen? Oh my goodness. It's the Lechonk from the tri... Freaking Satanned Psyduck. Um, you would imagine, like, that would be a good place to put one of the Elite Fours. I I'm hoping there's an Elite Four in this game. I, th I feel like there will be. Okay, freaking Ralts. Damn, Ralts, Ralts makes it in every game. Uh, Iggly... Iggly... Is that Igglybuff? Igglybuff! The point of being a baby Pokemon is that you're not in the wild. What the heck? Igglybuffs are in the wild. Okay, there's freaking Fido. Let's rob him. You gotta freaking stop, man. My shoulder's gonna break. Oh, it's a fairy. No, this is this is fine. Let's go, Fido. Burn. Burn, Fido. So all these Pokemon should be able to evolve. We get to see how... Once we level them up enough... You freaking paralyzed me. Once we level them up enough, we'll be able to see, like, a bunch of new Pokemon. It's gonna be sick. Okay, let's go. Throw ourselves a Pokeball. I'm so freaking... Uh, I'm so excited to go to the school, man. Meet the teachers. So far, the characters have been... Pretty good. Like, Nimona and Arvin. Arvin freaking... I can't believe this man is mean. Maybe he gets kind to us after, but this this is a mean man. Like, this man... Frick him. This Pokemon is smooth and moist to the touch. Yeast in its breath induces fermentation in the Pokemon's vicinity. Bruh. I'll freaking call you Rogers. It's a freaking Canadian joke, okay? It don't gotta make sense. Rogers has... <laughs> These nicknames. The only good nickname is freaking Chunkster. That's not even his name. Chunkus, I think. Hey, Nimona. Getting some gas? Oh, wait, damn. Well, over here. The freaking... That granny is a ghost. She's gonna be following us everywhere. Look at that 8-bit granny in the distance. So once we get near the gas station, we get the theme? Uh, okay. Leave it to the pros. Why is there a robot on the left? Who took that person's job? I want to just see Clavel working here one day. Leak points. Oh, they freaking gave a name to the currency. <laughs> Our currency is leak points. 
Or maybe he meant you buy leak points with one-to-one -one currency. What are you doing? Giving me leak? You just... You just gave me money? You can't see that, but she just gave me 5,000 leak points. I might have to move the face cam. Lots of Pokemon tiers. Okay, this is for TMs. Uh, we can go online. Had a rough adventure? Get to a Pokemon Center. You have to know this sort of stuff for quizzes at school. But mnemonics help out. Here's another one. Are you ready? Then let's go. Press R to send out my lead Pokemon. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How dare you. Okay, R. Uh, oh, let's go. Oh, that's amazing. I can just train my Pokemon. Let me just test it out real quick. Okay, Granny, I have to talk to you first. The Pokemon Center is a great... Damn, she's so moving. It's not even proper English, but you know what I mean. Uh, what, the, what is that? What is that? Is that a freaking human? What the... Oh. Got my Pokemon healed up. It's a trainer? Oh, it's a freaking whoopers. If you beat me, I'll tell you a cool secret. He's gonna freaking say I can read... Are you a seventh grade? Uh, third grader? <laughs> I'm going to a giant school. I must be in high school, right? Uh, okay, let's just beat this man up. I didn't even heal. I don't need the handouts, though. Look. Oh my frick, I need the handouts. Are you kidding me? How could you do this to me? I can't lose to this freaking dude. Isn't, isn't school starting? What you doing? I feel like if Pokemon were real, you would really see trainers who wake up at like 6 and are just posted up at places. I would do that. That sounds, that sounds fun. Okay, I gotta freaking move the face cam. Okay. Well, we'll flip it to the other side, I'm thinking. Does this work, guys? I hope it does. Oh, I lost even though my Pokemon had full HP. And mine didn't. Here's the secret. I freaking knew. You were disgusting. Oh, um, uh, what direction did I just come from? Okay, let's just try this out. Let's go mode. What the? Okay. Yo, that's some good experience. Are you kidding me? Yo, that's actually good experience. We about to... So I've heard that they can knock out shiny Pokemon. But, oh, he still feels the paralysis. But I feel like in a future update, they'll add it so, like, the Pokemon will maybe inform you when there's a shiny. You'll be like, wait, uh, Chonkus has found something. Or Chonkus wants your attention, you know? And then that'll be the... that I think that's what they'll do. Because that's pretty stupid that, uh... Wow, I've uh, filled up my party already. That'd be pretty stupid that they kill shiny Pokemon, you know? Especially if they appear shiny in the overworld. Did you know? Um, I, I, this is too much text for me to read. She's so kind. But what does she do on, like, the cold days? What? Stop, stop talking. I want to freaking let's go a bit more. <laughs> well, I want to catch the whooper. Oh, yeah, whooper will evolve differently, probably. I gotta freaking get that. Whooper. Oh, I got a uh, preemptive. So Whooper's a ground type in this game? Jeez, it's like chocolate flavor. I, I freaking Chonkus, take a bite of that. Who's that in the distance? Damn. Oh, it's freaking Pokeballs? Okay, let's just quickly catch this. Uh, who should I replace? No one so far. I want to see our Pokemon's evolutions. I guess they'll pop up in the wild as well. They'll pop up in the wild, true. I mean, like, trainers will have them. We should at least be able to get, like, Sting. What's its name? I don't even know. Whooper. Poison Ground. Was that what it was? Paul the Informed Whooper. After losing a territorial struggle, Whooper began living on land. Whoa. What did it fight with? The Pokemon changed over time, developing a poisonous film to protect his body. Okay, I remember. Alright, I'm gonna name you... Wanzo. Yeah? Facts. Wanzo. <laughs> Wanzo. You're gonna have to go to the box for now, okay? We're gonna have to evolve some of our Pokemon. The Whooper book. Okay, Pokemon 53. 
There's also, remember, uh, Gimme Goal? I gotta see if this man is like Pokemon 999. Okay, here we go. Fido. Let's. Oh, look at that freaking 8 bit bounce suite. Los Platos. Okay, look at all these dudes. This is Los Platos. We're always happy to serve up a helping of hostility to anyone passing by. Wow. This is a huge. Like, hold on. Look at the map. It's just a. Please don't talk to me. Wait, you can find Hapini? It's just a little place. I mean, there. Wait, no. No, undo that. Okay. I mean, there's not many locations in this game, right? Because it's like this open world thing. I wish I had a Pokemon like a Lechonk. But like, look, there's some detail in this place. Stop freaking ducking. No, stop it. Sure does take a lot to, of walking to get around. Have you heard that Pelipper can carry letters and packages? That freaking Pelipper. What to do next? Look, uh, the trainers in the wild. Who the heck? Who's the man with sunglasses? To school, is it? Off to school now, dear. Careful on the road and remember to jot things down so you won't forget what you've accomplished. That's a nice little town. What the frick? There's a dude sitting. He looks like an NBA player. Nothing like relaxing on the grass. Freaking fledglings in the tree. I was trying to shake it. So if I go this way, what happens? If I go this way... Oh, it just really loops. Or I can get into the wilderness. This is open world. I don't have Coridon yet, so it's not worth me walking. But technically, I... I whoa. So I, I feel like the game has a, a path you should take. Like, the gyms are from weakest to strongest, right? But there won't be anyone blocking your path. So you can do whatever you want. I think that's pretty sick. Stored power, ain't no one using that. Like, I could walk to, like, as far as the snowy place, catch freaking level 40s, and come back. That I shouldn't freaking right now. I, I need to wait for Coridon. Let's see, if I open the map now, this is the, this is the kind of thing that leaked Pokemon in one of their trailers on the mini map. So that's how it worked. <laughs> I got two. Is this the way to school, by the way? Oh, it is. That other path just loops the same way. Wow, there's like a lot of Pokemon centers in between. Okay, let's fight this dude. I got two old Pokemon in my cooler. What? Yo, this man's the size of my like foot. Did you see that? Pair the student. Azuro, show me some Gen 9 mods. What the frick? Flying Foy Poco. That's crazy. No. Oh, you can run away from trainer battles now. We are in generation... Nine. Yeah, this face cam is... Uh, go okay, location. We're in generation 9. Like, that's crazy. Like, when, when did we get here? Sun and Moon was 2016, 2017. Remember the hype around Alternate Cosma? Because they didn't leak it in the trailers? That was five freaking years ago. The heck? What's that Lechonk doing? He's like scared of the battle. <laughs> okay. So I guess I can avoid these trainer battles. Just to make this a bit more challenging for myself. You know, I just have to use let's go mode on wild Pokemon and I never really have to do trainer battles. <laughs> you know, just to like get through the game. If you want to play properly, yeah, you could complete it, beat all the trainers, but... If you're just trying to play a good amount in, in the time you have in a day... You can't, uh, waste it fighting trainers. You are the last trainer I'll ever fight pair. You have that... Honor. I'm gonna check up on this Lechonk, make sure it lives a full life of happiness. Lechonk, what's wrong? Lechonk, how did that happen? So look, I got mad experience for that. What the frick? Grandma Wilma wants to fight me? This is insane. Wait, this makes no sense. Why would I ever do... Why would I ever do these trainer battles? They're not only optional, they're almost... Re redundant? What's the word? Look at this crap, man. I'm just exploring. See, like... So, think of a Kanto, right? When you had to go from route to route, you, you mostly had to stay within their lines, right? 
I'm literally going into the the gray zone. You know? Like uh, Diamond and Pearl, just... What is it called? Mystery zone? What is that? It's like I'm in the mystery zone. I'm doing whatever I want. Oh my goodness! Our new challenger approaches! Is that Scatterbook or what? What the frick is that? Ew! Oh my goodness! That's the pre evolu I didn't know I had a pre-evolution! That's my dog from the trailer! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! No way! Oh wow! I wonder if he's a three-stage mon or not. I think I can catch it like this. Shrewdle, like Poodle, got the little candle on its head. That's definitely the pre-evolution. Weird, so they showed us a mid-stage Pokemon in that trailer. Um, okay, uh, Sting. String, that's what I call them. I don't want this move. I need String to hit, like, level 7, and I feel like he might evolve. Shrewdle, the Toxic Mouse? Wait. <laughs> Wait. What is... What, what? Is there a mouse name that sounds like Shrewdle? Mouse? Is this not... You know, the Pokemon I was just mentioning? Though usually a mellow Pokemon, it will sink its sharp, poison-soaked front teeth into... <laughs> Any that it's not the thing. I have to fix my face cam, by the way. The thing was a freaking uh, ghost. This thing is poison normal. <laughs> That's just a crazy coincidence that its name sounds like Poodle, and then what the and it has like some candle thing on your head. I'm just I'll call you freaking like what? What's the chocolate that has Hershey Kisses, bruh? I ain't naming a Pokemon Kisses. I'll call you Kiss Dre. All right, it's much better. Um, you gotta go to the box, man. We gotta evolve our party. It is kind of cute still. Okay, Wiglet is 288. Um, you wanna die, my dude? Okay, die. Like Foy Coco, I feel like is taking less health damage. My Pokedex is being updated too. Eventually, Chonkus wears itself out. He doesn't fight anymore? No, he does fight. Oh god, Oricorio. These suckers escaped Alola. So they wear themselves out, but it's not like permanent. You can still send them out. Of it. Frick, there's like no... Oh my god, my Chonkus has like one health. Damn. I mean, okay, hold up. Okay, let's try String. I just want you to evolve. Let's try this. It's level 5, so it'll probably do proper damage to me. Okay, this is sick. Oh god, don't fight that. Oh god, it, it actually picked... It <laughs> It ran away? I need you to evolve, man. I, I want you to hit level... We'll make... Wait, we'll stop it. We'll make... We'll make Wanda, Wanda fight. Um... I want you to hit level 7. I just want to see if you'll evolve. This is interesting. I'm going to get so lazy off this. I I'm never going to... Oh, I should fight the Bonsly. I'm going to be like so lazy to do normal... Okay, you all wear your... That's good. That's good they wear themselves out fast. You can't spam it as much as you thought. Okay, we'll have to wait to hit level 7. We'll hit it in the freaking school. What is that? What the frick? Just sleeping skull. Is there anything in the tree? I think there's an item up there. Nah. We move Trudel? What the? Oh, it's just fledgling. Okay. Everything's fine. It's really cool. It, it, it's really like you're out exploring. Uh, in real life, I mean, like, you have to properly look at stuff and see if it's a new Pokemon or not. That's the this. That's like the beauty of not looking at leaks as well. Okay, there's a freaking evolved scatterbug, whatever you call it. We are in Mesagoza. We have made it. It took us some time too. That was like a that was like a fun little exploration. Latronks? Did I catch a Latronk? I did. 
Yes, this is it. Man, get get away from my face. <laughs> Who's this man in the suit? Oh, we got some students. I don't want to freak. I feel like if they have yellow dialogue, they want to freaking fight me. I ain't about that life. I quit that life like 20 minutes ago. Okay, we have to jump into Mesa Goza. If we caught String this early, he must be like... What? You keep giving me tips. How did you say open the camera? I should have probably read that. Oh god, leave me alone. Please, I'll save my game. Offline mode. Oh, I guess I can mess with my set. What happens in options? Tech speed fast, skip move learning. Give nicknames. Skip cut scenes. Uh, okay. Um, just confirm. Get me out of here. Let's go to Mesa Goza. Mesa Goza time. Okay. Where's Namona? Where's Arvin? These doors look like chocolate. I'm a kid. I'm a first day of school. Oh, it's It's my best friend. Did you battle some trainers? Hell no. Oh, you wanna fight? Oh, I wonder if I if I say I don't know if she actually doesn't fight. Okay. Nothing like having a friend around. Oh shoot, we're gonna fight in the <laughs> middle of the street? I'm I'm really curious. See, so this game started this game did two things. It started the mystery of Arvin, which I did not expect at all that they'd make Arvin a mystery. It's probably level seven. Level eight if we're lucky. You seem like you're getting better at this, so I'm coming at you with two Pokemon this time. Oh, level eight, Wanda. Wanda's gonna die out here. Okay, just kill. I shouldn't let you kill Wanda. I need the experience. Okay, I'll go into freaking Chunk Chunkus. Wanda, I know you have. Wanda, I know you have freaking leafage. Gosh, this thing is frail. Oh wow, Terra types. Fire Terra, Electric. Oh, so there's a tendency that Pokemon will have their own typing as the Terra type. Whoa, I never thought of it like that. I thought it would be like soup. Koridon, why can't I use you? I thought it'd be kind of all over the place, but that seems to make sense. It would be special that their Terra type would be different. Okay, let's see this. Yes, we have the mystery of Arvin because he knows Koridon. He's the son of Sada and Turo as as well, I guess. Not both of them at the same time. But I would I feel like Sada comes from the past. Tour from the future, they have somehow the same kid. You really work your type matchups. I can tell a badly one win. And I've I'm wondering if he's also from that time period. Or if the parent had them after they came here. If it's true, they time travel. But then we also have like a mystery for Nimona because she's like... She's so friendly like she wants company. Wants people to share experiences with. Um, and then... Well, there's... Well, what else? I don't remember what else I was going to say. Okay, let's see. Pommy. Uh, Pommy is electric. I'll stay in. Wow, doing even better than I expected. You're legit, Tamo. I am, fam. Pami level. It should be higher leveled. Wow. This is the first time <laughs> the trainer's other Pokemon are higher leveled. Battling is a blast. I think I better pull out my ace in the hole. She can trust lines? No freaking way. <laughs> That's crazy. Damn. I can respect that. You know how long you have to wait for Mega Evolution to be used in battle? This is good right off the bat. Terrestrializing is always a solid strategy. It gives moves of the Pokemon's Terra type more power. That's gonna freaking do like half. Oh, okay, okay. If it did like half, I was gonna say that. That's kind of hard. Like people would lose this battle. People would still lose this battle, I mean. That's insane! It's actually kinda hard! It's- 
Oh, if I didn't crit. Oh, no, I didn't crit. I have Blaze. If I didn't have Blaze, I would have lost uh, Fai Coco and had to use someone else. Okay, String is level 7. Let's see if uh, it evolves. Chunkus wants to learn Bite. It's about time, my dude. So I have Special Attack. I could use Round. Okay, we get rid of Tackle. Can I get some held items soon? I guess I didn't go to the shop. Man, I can't believe how fast you're improving. Damn, she pays me. You could pay me a lot. Okay, no evolution. Okay. Maybe it's like a legit bug type. Amazing, look at you taking on a terrestrialized opponent and winning. No problem. Come to think of it, you can't terrestrialize your Pokemon yet, huh? Don't worry, I'll get you taken care of. You're so good with Pokemon battles, I forget how new you are to this stuff sometimes. Anyway, it was fun to battle you. Here, have some revives as thanks. I feel like you could actually lose to that battle. That was a strong Pommy. I wonder if Pommies are like... Now, Mesagos is waiting just past this gate. At last, the city where our school is. There's a ton of hills and stairs and stuff in the city, so I'm going to take a quick breather and then catch up with you soon. Damn, you need a breather before the stairs? I wonder if Pommy could be your starter, but I would assume she has more Pokemon than that. But that would, she did a lot of damage. Because she had Stab and Terrastal on that electric damage. And she was level 9. So if you weren't paying proper attention, that that's it's that's interesting. Because I've been kind of cheating over leveling a bit and I'm only level 11. She came up with freaking level 9s. You call this... Uh, yo, this... This is a luxurious ass... Alright, here I am. We finally made it, huh? Is it like... This is Mesagos, the biggest city in Paldia. It's a big trade-up since a long time ago. Lots of folks come here to learn about advances in technology and all kinds of other stuff. This is a song we heard in the trailer. There's a hair salon, okay. What's that Pokemon on the hair salon uh, logo? Is that a freaking teacher? What do you want to see first, Damo? Uh, food. Haha, <laughs> I didn't have you pegged for a big eater. But that's smart. You can't battle with the growling tummy, right? Oh, and speaking of battling... I want to be sure you'll be able to trust your Pokemon too, Tamo. There's a few things that gotta get done for that to happen, but I'll take care of him. Oh my god, she's the president. Damn, if she's the president, how does she not have, like, proper friends? Delibird presents. Oh, items for my Pokemon to hold? Once you've seen your fill. Okay, let's go. I'm freaking hungry in real life, man. <laughs> I hope you can't tell. I hope I don't sound like I have no energy. Um, okay, let's go. Is this Delibird Gifts? How cute. KBN. Can I freaking have a gift? So, at first I was gonna say, is this whole city like a school city? But nah, 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 nah. It's a normal city and it just happens to like... Be like the capital of a huge school. Something like that. Uh, this is for... This is for coffee. Anyone want no coffee? I want Delibird Gifts. Oh, I think my daughter really... My daughter is the most. Yeah, yeah. Both y'all daughters suck. Have you seen Gita daughter? Vending machine. Are you gonna take 18 years? What the frick? Do you wanna play with... Play with Casher? Never mind, bro. <laughs> You've ruined the mood. The freaking Casher debit. How would you like to pay? Oh god, here we go. Let me get some sandwiches. My Koraidon. What the frick? Oh. Um. Damn. This is. In these are RPG things. Or JRPG things. You know, boosted experience fighting dragons, I assume that's what it is. Or boosted experience for dragons. It's hard to tell. Humongo power. I don't need it. Uh. Look what the freaking man is gonna. He's enjoying his life. And what the hell are you doing? Dude's kissing his glass of water. 
<laughs> the gulpin's on the freaking bed. Oh, shoot. Slow poke. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. New sandwiches. The people with yellow dialogue. I, I, I should give that man a try. F him. Next yellow dialogue I'll freaking look at. This is Deli Bird Gifts. It's like, it's, there's not even like a... Wow, we can't bring the camera with us into the store. But that's pretty good. Okay, so it's the same thing. So people will come up with stuff you should buy here and it'll help you throughout the game. Nice. Okay. Oh, shoot. Dry curry? Okay, F all this. I got- I, I need to know what- what- what it means when it like boosts XP for a certain Pokemon. This looks like a post office. Go for broke? Yeah, I'll be broke if I buy that. You see the- it's like, No! Am I not allowed to leave? I, I- Look, I had to sneak out. You see me ducking? Hey, it wouldn't let me go. Okay, so. Um, Deli Bird Gifts. It's none of these either. A freaking egg? Yo, are there still potions in this game? <laughs> Fruit veggies. What's his problem? Oh my goodness, banana. I feel like I'll see banana recovers 15 health. <laughs> Yo, what if they did that? It's because when Pokemon started, you know, we had cloning and stuff. So, by, so they made potions and stuff to go with that. It's like a bit developed. But if they were to restart Pokemon, you'd probably have like bananas and stuff to give them and they'd it'd recover their health. You selling sushi? Okay, yellow dialogue. It doesn't necessarily mean they want to... I just want general XP power. You know what? We'll buy the fizzy pop ice cream. And I'll eat it. So this one is for normal. Freaking Coridon. <laughs> I have seven Pokemon on my party. Look at Coridon. So we'll see if this... We'll see what that does. XP point power normal. Uh, but I mean, I have to hope I can fight like normal trainers in here. Because I don't want to go back out there. Okay. Um, Where the frick is the school? I feel like lost it. Maybe it's that way? What? I guess it's this way. I can't even tell. This is a huge freaking place. I'm just kind of taking it in now. This is huge. It's so big. I almost don't... I can't even go through it. Okay. What the frick is this? Freaking Victory Road? Yeah. And <laughs> the mon is waiting for you. I don't know the way to the academy. How far are you going to kick me out? I'm not even moving. You just walk me to Nomona at that point. Okay. The, I, I guess the big stairs I gotta take. All these uh, freaking students. I'm playing with like a, a, a early version of the game. So I wonder if like the little things you're seeing. Like the flashes. If they'll disappear. Oh my goodness. I forget her name. It's Penny. Look. Team Star. She's freaking in it. She's, she's Mela. She's Mela. This is how she joins. We'll see. We'll see. Don't you get it? If you join Team Star, you can shine as bright as anybody. Seriously, what's with you? Don't you want to burn bright with awesome friends like us? Not really. Look, we've got a quota we're supposed to fill for new members. So just sign up already. Um, I'd rather not. Uh, walk away. Oh, you can choose to participate? No, you have to. <laughs> Stop picking the negative option. <laughs> Don't make me watch the whole thing again. No, okay, okay, okay. We'll help her. Huh? You want in on this too? If you're here to sign up, we'll get to you next. We nearly got this one in the bag. We're Team Star, kid. Do your little dance. We burn too bright to even look at directly, but you knew that, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, another ignorant nobody. Okay, I ain't even gonna push A. 
you're gonna be subjected to this for like 20 more seconds. It's like she's milking udders or something. She's speed running the, the freaking farm challenge. She's, she's, she's tracking her. Look at her head. She's like, oh yeah, yeah. Sure, she's moving. Here, I'm finally a part of Team Star and I still get no respect. I gotta work my way up the ranks. Hey, we can't just let something like this slide. The honor of our team's on the line, so we got no real choice but to battle, yeah? That's true. You keep watching that little four eyes over there. I'll make sure this fresh face nobody ends up seeing stars. What, we really respectfully back away? There's no way this is a true evil team, unless it's one of the higher ups. That, that's evil, and these guys just don't know what's going on. Oh, shoot. So what is this man? Poison normal? Let's mud slap him. To learn freaking Pokemon again. I did not get a Wiglet to use freaking ground moves again. <laughs> I'm surprised how early in the game he popped up. Okay, this is gonna freaking take a while. Yeah, kill Wanda, man. I have things to do, okay? I'm just gonna switch into freaking Chunkster. I'm surprised. They're doing a decent chunk. The, the game is not easy. I'm surprised. I expected it to be. So far, it's normal, I'd say. Yo, this sounds like the freaking music one of the bosses would have. It sounds like freaking... Is this Toby Fox? I was gonna say something of fighting an Undertale boss. This is this is I'm 93% sure this is Toby Fox. What the frick is with their eyes? How come I'm the one seeing stars? That's Toby Fox. That's freaking Toby Fox. Eric, why isn't nobody like you so good at battling anyway? That's just not right. No way he beats you? Does that mean I gotta battle this kid now since I'm higher up Team Star's ranks? Pero bueno, what do you think you're doing? I'm class president, go to school. Oh, it's that student council dweeb. She's gonna report us if we don't book it. <laughs> I can't believe you, Demo. You don't have to go find randos to battle. You'll have all the battles you'll ever need with me. That's hilarious. That's not what happened. Wait, they picked a fight with you? Wow, I read that the wrong way, sorry. <laughs> I get it now. You two have got Team Star written all over you for sure. I bet you're trying to pressure people into signing up again, weren't you? Uh, hi. We weren't, uh, not doing that. We weren't not doing that. Well, that explains it. As head of the student council, stopping this type of nonsense would normally be my job. But this is also the perfect chance for you to try my amazing and ultra rare gift. She hooked it up already? Damn. We speed ran to the freaking mechanic. I wonder what the origin to this Terra stuff is. No, 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 no. Not Wiglet. I don't care for Wiglet. You gonna watch me fight another? You want this? <laughs> this kid's peeing his pants. Wait, what? Or her pants. I can't tell. Wait, what? You want this kid to practice wailing on us with this Terra Pokemon? Is that it? Got a problem? You want to battle me instead? Eh, never mind. I'll take my chances with the new kid. Then take your places and battle. Freaking Wiglet is in the front. <laughs> He's crying. He really don't want to do this. Young Goose, bro, you deserve to lose. Okay, so there's a hierarchy. Fine, Wiglet. Are you dead? Oh, you fully healed you. Okay. Double stab. There's a lot to uncover in this game, man. I'm thinking of the other stuff we saw in the trailers. I can't wait to get to, to those points. Let's see how much this does. My goodness. She's dancing to his theme song. How did you do that much? What did you use? 
she's dancing to his theme. That's amazing. Is she on B? She's like slightly on B, but a little... It, 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 it goes off balance after a while. She freaking still dancing. Your Pokemon burned so bright. Okay. She's still dancing. <laughs> nice, Tamu. You pulled off Trastalizing, no problem. Moves of your Pokemon's Terra type will hit even harder when it's Trastalized, you know. Sometimes you'll find a Pokemon whose Terra type is totally different from its usual type. That difference can open up your strategic options. Gotta charge your Terra Orb at a Pokemon Center after every use by healing up your team, though. Uh, how dare you? <laughs> Wait. I mean, it makes sense. So you can't just spam it going through a route. You gotta only use it. It makes sense, though. It's really overpowered. So yeah, Team Star is basically a group of students that like to kick up trouble. They hardly ever show up to class, and when they get together in groups, they're a real headache. Even the teachers don't know what to do with them, from what I hear. Um, excuse me. I, uh, I just, well, thanks. Are you sure you're not in Team Star? So, yeah, see you around. Do you know her, Namona? Oh, look at you, Tamu. Already becoming a big hero around campus. I don't think I've seen that girl around. Maybe she's a new transfer like you. That Eevee bag, though. Love that fluff. Anyway, seems like the troubles died down, so we'd better book it up to school. Get ready to climb the worst staircase in the world. That's funny. That's funny. I like that. Do I, do I have to climb it? Okay. Oh, my goodness. Let's see how he climbs. This man just... What the, this man is... <laughs> damn. This man is speed run. Okay, I'm trying to catch him slipping. There you go. He's in this. No, he's. Yeah, he's really climbing the stairs. So you have to heal after trastalizing. That that makes sense. That makes sense. It stops you from using it every battle because it's so easy. Aside from the the animation, but it's not too long. I'm used to the freaking Dynamax animation. And it being limited like that gives you reason not to use it, you know? Which is important as well, or else you'll feel weird, you know? Like Z-moves, you could use it every battle, but you didn't, and it starts to feel weird after a while. Here we are, Thamo. Welcome to Naranya Academy. This here is the entrance hall. You can sign up for all kinds of classes at the desk behind me, and those halls off to the side lead to different parts of the school. It's totally big enough to let loose and battle in here, but for some reason, they banned Pokemon battling in the main entrance. Oh, we can't battle in the lobby here. Master Damo, Miss Nimona. How did you find your first school commute? How did he get here before us? Oh, he left. He left already, okay. <laughs> okay, I thought he left after us. Oh dear, was it really? I suppose Miss Nimona must have led you on quite the adventure. Not that I was expecting any less from our champion rank student council president. Reliable as ever, Miss Nimona. Well, I know how to look after my friends, right, Tamo? Oh, but speaking of which, we saw some of those Team Star kids in town director. You did? Where? It was down the stairs from the front gate. They were hassling this kid with an Eevee backpack. That is quite the news. Are they still to be found out there? Actually, Tamo flexed on him and ran him off. You don't say, my son grown so fast. Of course, it's a fine thing to try to help a fellow student, Master Tamo, but you might wish to show a bit of restraint as you find your feet here at the academy. What does that mean? <laughs> and Miss Nimona, do remember that the school staff is here to resolve any such trouble. Well, they, they're clearly not. Uh, right. Yes, sir, director. But that's... that's I, I, I like to hear that because... You know, it makes no sense that the teachers wouldn't be doing anything. A child with an Eevee backpack, you say? I suppose that might have been Miss Penny. I'm relieved to hear she's come to class at least. Ah, and Miss Namona? If you'd be so good, do report to Jack about this Team Star business. As your homeroom teacher, he should be kept apprised of such going on. He's my homeroom too? Have a look at the time. You two had better hurry along. Okay, homeroom. Hey, we got classes. This is good. This is good. This will be very fun. 
You notice the dialog is more like Legends Arceus. It's nice. The frick, 8 bit students. Good morning, Mr. Jack. How come I don't sit beside Nimona? Where even am I? Hello, hello, everyone. We have some exciting news this morning. Who wants to hear it? Oh, me. I want to hear the news. Do we have two students? We have our new little friend joining our group. Damn, so Penny's not in our class. Whisper, 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 whisper. I wonder what they'll be like. All right, you can come on in. Hello, everyone. My name's Damo. Could I trouble you? <laughs> this is so funny. I feel like... I feel like there must be a patch that comes out that makes it less like this. Could I trouble you for a few words introducing yourself? How dare you? So calm and collected, he's pretty cool. Looks like everyone's eager to get to know you, Tamo. Alright then. Who wants to be the first to ask our new friend a question? Mimi, can I ask a question? What's your favorite thing about Pokemon? I love everything about Pokemon. Really awesome, me too. Does anyone else have a question? <laughs> Me, I have a question. Do you want a battle? You went to all the trouble of enrolling. You're so spilt, Ammo. What do you hope to get out of it? You must have some kind of dream, right? So, I want to be a strong trainer. This is the one. But there's like a... There's a theme in this game of treasure. Everyone brings up what their treasure is. I wonder if she'll mention it. Oh, you will be. I just know it. You and me. We're going to get so strong battling together. Well, thank you for telling us a bit about yourself, Damo. I'm Mr. Jack. I, or Jack, I teach biology here. <laughs> at the academy, and I'm also your homeroom teacher. That's your seat. It's like, I swear someone was sitting there, were they not? Alright, you ragamuffins. Be nice and friendly to our new classmate. We will, Mr. Jack. 8-bit Jack. How was class? Get to know the academy campus by exploring. Uh, I better. I buy. I buy. Ooh, a biology math. Give me a freaking second. We have classes to go to. Unbelievable. I'm freaking blown away. This is this is good. This is a good game, man. So far, I don't want to do classes. Oh my god, a staff room! Let me meet Namona in the staff room! Y'all ever been staff in your school? You ever been office helpers? <laughs> I always used to feel like, hey, I'm a thug out here. I was office helper. So, you know, kids who are injured will come into the office and I'd be like, yo, what you need? You need some eyes here. I'm, I'm freaking so cool. <laughs> I had more words in my head. I'm too tired. <laughs> the best I could say was I'm cool. You know, your staff, you're the school staff now. You're chilling for 30 minutes a day during recess. <laughs> Why would someone choose to freaking spend their recess in an office? It's only once a week. Okay. And also, uh, you do it with a freaking partner, and my partner would go in the freaking principal's fridge and steal like freezies. I wonder why I didn't. Oh, hey, so we meet again. You remember me, right? Are you freaking kind again? I don't think we've met! <laughs> but come on, I give you credits, Pokemon. Did I forget to introduce myself? Well, the name's Arvin. What the frick? There's bees on the pots. Slow cook pots. No need to tell me your name, Thamo, right? Whole school seems to be talking about you. The new kid who showed up with the president of the student council. What, they jealous? Wait. Does she... Why? Why would that be noticeable? It's like she don't have friends? I normally wouldn't even bother showing up for class, but I came all the way to school today just to talk with you, our new celebrity. You've got to help me out so I can finally make my dream a reality. Bro, but you're so mean. Like, I'll help you. What's this dream first? Hehe, <laughs> got your interest, Devi. You want to hear all about my dream, right? Well, well, this might come as a surprise, but fact is, I'm, I'm all about th that picnic life, the great outdoors. The perfectly prepared sandwiches, all of it. And not half bad at cooking either, I tell you. Right now, I'm researching new recipes. Is that the freaking Koraidon book? Why would there be recipes in there? I found this book the other day. And it had a section about these Herba Mystica things. 
basically, there's some kind of special herbs that heal up any Pokemon as soon as it eats them. Now, there are a total of five different types of Herba Mystica based on what I read. Just taking a lick of them, once they've been powdered, will get your blood flowing, provide nutrients, prevent aging. It'll even boost the immune system. These herbs seem like they're the real deal, only found here in Paldia and rare to boot. He gives me freaking Volo vibes, but I know he's not evil. He can't be. But this book says they're all guarded by Titan Pokemon, meaning that it's going to be pretty tough to try and grab even a few sprigs. Because, see, Titans are, well, I think they've got to beat things like this. Oh! Ancient Dawnfan, a uh, great tusk. Monsters of a Area Zero. Area Zero sounds... It's like Area 51. As we descended further into Area Zero, we began to catch glimpses of mysterious Pokemon, though we wondered if these huge, ferocious beasts were indeed Pokemon at all. One of our teams suffered a brutal blow from such a beast and was mortally wounded, forcing us to retreat for a time. It's like they found like some Jurassic Park place. Like, how could you find ancient po- a member of the survey team captured this photograph by chance. So this is a modern photo. I thought this was like a photo from like a hundred years ago. I noticed the passing resemblance to the Pokemon known as Don Fan. The first time they mentioned the correlation. Yet differences such as its sheer size and the shape of its back set it apart as do its great tusks. So that's what they call it. I really want to get those herbs myself, but I'm not gonna go ask Nimona. Don't have any friends with strong Pokemon to lend me a hand either. Maybe if we weren't so freaking mean to her. And if and I'd never hear the end of it if I went crawling to that student council girl. But here you can sacrifice that for your dream. But here you waltz up. You've gotta help me out with this. You'd be perfect. Um No. No, wait, I don't need an answer yet. I'll just register the places where it seems there might be titans in your map app. Hey, no means no. You got a freaking Flabebe phone case. Whoa, this is the region. Oh my goodness. Stony Cliff, that's cloth. I can take out False Dragon Titan? Whoa. Wait, are, are these like pixelated images of the Pokemon? So Stony Cliffs, is that cloth? Because I'm trying to look at the other pictures. Look at open Sky Titan. It looks like some serpent dragon. You know, we don't really have serpent dragons like Rayquaza. It'd be cool if there's like a normal Pokemon like that. Wow, I want to freaking go to the false dragon Titan. No, wait, no. Why? I want to talk to- I want to go to the other classes. Let it do a bit. Okay, yeah, cool. Damn, you gave me like five thousand dollars. Okay, let me get out of here. Give the idea some time, please. What the frick? That pot just had hands. Is there a girl behind this? Oh my goodness! I'm ready for second meal powers. What kind of combi food is this? Oh, it's the cafeteria. Nimona, the only one who has my number. It is the big bad. Or it's my daddy. This is Thamu, correct? Hey! Hey! <laughs> this better not be a prank. This better be some evil crap. It's freaking Team Star, isn't it? We're not ready for the big evil stuff yet. I already know. Well, I'm assuming. I hacked your smartphone so I could talk to you. Hope you don't mind. What do you mean, hacked? Well, as far as you're concerned, it means I'm basically in control of your phone right now. He got my team viewer ID. My name's Cassiopeia. But never mind that. It's you I want to talk about. I hear you're a trainer with serious potential. If that description is accurate, there's something I'd like to ask you. I'm not joining. I mean, I'll be so happy if I, I'm able to join. Tell me, Demo. You know about Team Star, right? <laughs> Don't nod. Nice try. But I know for a fact you've already crossed paths with them. T 
Team Star. It's probably a girl. I don't know why I'm giving her this voice. Team Star is a group of troublemakers formed by some academy students a while back. They cause headaches for the school and try to bring other students down to their level. Wait, you don't sound like you're in it. And I refuse to sit idly by and let them get away with it. Watch this be Nimona with a secret identity or Penny. So I've come up with a plan to bring down Team Star and force them to disband for good. Call it Operation Starfall. I uh, don't tell Necros me to be pissed, but I'll need allies to carry out this operation, and I'd like you to be one of them. So, this is interesting. Because they made me a celebrity, this actually makes sense. No need to reply to second. We can discuss the details some other time. I gotta stop ne giving negative answers. Oh no. Okay, I guess it's not you. Ah, Master Thambo. Could I get you some bread? Please do try to keep your voice down if you're making calls within the school, won't you? I'll be more careful. You want to wear some socks? You don't want anyone else overhearing personal information after all. Honestly, there's so many things we need to be careful about in this day and age. What the frick? Some realism? I, I was I was hacked, bro. Like, that is some... Hey! What the frick is that? Is that your son? Daughter? Team Star, you say? Okay. <laughs> Imagine he's the leader of Team Star. He's trying to like get some school budget crap going on. I want to go to my other classes. Who the frick? Oh, it's me. No, no, no. Let me go to my other classes. Don't tell me I had to pick one specific class. That'll be so sad. What the frick? Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Um, I was gonna take my biology class. Let me just check this out. It seems I, I might, it seems optional though. I mean, it's freaking over. Who's who's freaking Patrice is on the thing? Okay, let's get out of here. We go to the staff room. No, I don't think it's optional actually. I think I have to go to my class. Whoa, the freaking teacher. Yo, mommy. She's here. Is that your daddy? That is some wild hair. Very well, champion Nimona. I trust you to handle this in my steed. That is your mommy. And possibly mine. You know, that's like she's cutely calling her champion Nimona. Sure thing, you can count on me, mom. I In fact, I bet this is going to be fun. So she has a good relationship with her. She sees her. I'm glad to hear it. Good day, then. Hi, champion. Oh, pardon me. No, speak some more. Oh, Tamo, hey. She had a lot of friends. She looked awesome. They call her La Primera. Good eye. She sure is. That lady as well. They call her the La Primera. She don't... S She's strong. She can do pretty much anything. She's got cool practically coming out of her ears. That's not your mommy. That's your role model. Okay. So who is your rich parents? You're so rich. <laughs> Unless you adopt it and she's your real mommy. Okay, we've come back to the same point. She's basically everything I want to be or that any Pokemon trainer would want to be really. Which reminds me, remember in Homeroom when I asked you what your dream is? Well, since you're... Oh, she remembers that decision. Oh, shoot. Well, since your heart's already set on becoming a really strong trainer, I've got an idea for you. You should- She's actually champion rank? Wait a second! She should be way stronger then! You should try to reach champion rank like me. It might be something else. Yeah, I will. Oh wow, hang on though. I've got a whole spiel I want to give you. Here goes. The trainers who reach champion rank are the ones who raise their Pokemon really strong. They're pro-tier battlers. Their moves keep crowds on the edge of their seats. You have to prove yourself to the Pokemon League to officially get the title of champion. You beat all the gym leaders, right? Oh my goodness. This ain't a rival. This is like an actual hurdle. Um, There's like a better word. And to do that, you have to do more than just take classes here. She freaking 
already beat the game. Well, that guy is flipping back and forth through his book. You gotta take on eight Pokemon gyms and win so you can collect their gym badges. Once you've done that, all that's left is the special test, the champion assessment. She freaking did all of that. And once you pass that, then at long last you'll be a champion. It's every Pokemon trainer's dream. The coolest title anyone could ever hope to get. Not to brag or anything. I reached champion rank during our last treasure hunt, you know. Oh, last year. What school did I go to before this? Imagine there's normal schools and then like full on Pokemon schools. But normal schools. <laughs> and I, that's where I was. Oh, the, tre the treasure hunt is a special independent study thing we've got here. Should happen soon. Our last one started not long after the beginning of the school year. It's great, you get to leave school to go on an adventure and learn however you want. I guess you could say my journey to becoming a champion was the treasure I found maybe. There you go. That's her mentioning the treasure. I don't know if that's the answer I'm looking for. It seems like a pretty big treasure. Especially if that's your dream. Anyway, I've got a feeling I'd be able to get even stronger if you and I were both working at it. That's true. Let me go ahead and save the gym's low. Oh my goodness. Frick. Okay, thank you, lady. Oh. Oh. Hell. Who the frick is Kaskarafa gym man? Levincia gym. Victory Road. This is the three paths. I gotta talk to the staff. Give it some thought. So I like it more that she's not Gita's daughter. That's interesting. Uh, ding dong ding dong. Please. Oh my goodness. I didn't sign up for Team Star, bro. My daddy is obsessed with me. Once again, Master Tambo to the director's office, please. <laughs> these, these, these are some good vibes, man. But F you, I'm talking to people. Oh, I can't talk to them. Can I talk to you? Look at this lady's design. Rye for it. Taking time out your day to attempt to converse with me? You must be absolutely mad. Excuse me? Damn, you got some style though. Damn. Look at her freaking necklace or freaking the bottom of her jeans. You freaking grilling me? Yeah, make it awkward. Don't you freak. I love you. Her name is Time. Hello, Demo. Feel free to come ask me questions sometimes. Well, right now would have been a time. These are all staff members. So colorful. Wait, <laughs> he's reading a... Wait, wait, wait. I gotta talk to this guy. This freaking, um... What's his name? The freaking journal villain. Journal Giovanna villain. Uh, whoa. Thanks for coming to say bonjour. Salvatore... The freaking... I don't want to go there. I want to go do my biology class. He's going to give his freaking gets his speech soon. And I'm going to cry. Damo, you've been a naughty, naughty boy. He wasn't even looking at the paper. He was, he was, he was like, he was like a robot turned off. Thank you for coming, Master Damo. Have you been enjoying your time here at Naranya Academy? I see. They remember your choices. Stop doing that. Do remember, I'm always here to lend in here. Should you find yourself struggling in any way. Now, you may be wondering why we could not have simply conversed earlier in the cafeteria. But let me assure you, there's a reason why I asked you to meet me in my office. It seems that a friend of mine has a rather serious matter they would like to discuss with you. You know Cleopatra Lacasio lady? Is that a fossil? I know. I'm afraid they aren't actually here in this room with us. One moment, please. You have her on phone. It's Casanova Pia. Is it freaking anonymous? Oh! How is she not here with us? What's good? You... Wait, I'm not sure if this is evil or like Techno Flintstones. 
Or just normal Flintstones. This is like Flintstones going on a, a, a sick adventure one episode. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> this is like... Hello, Demo. It's nice to meet you. It couldn't have been her. She hasn't... She don't care about Team Star. She's researching the crater. She's from the past. And the freaking crater spits out things from the past. Or it must have at some point. Well, just maybe once and she came out of it. That's my theory. My name is Professor Sada. I carry out Pokemon research within the great crater of Paldia. At a site known as Area Zero. Oh my lord. Please don't ask me to return Coridon. That's my dog. The professor is, in fact, a graduate of our fine academy, as well as a splendid researcher. There's no way. Hmm. So she's probably near there right now. Well, allow me to get straight to the point. Damo, student ID 805C393. You are the student who travels with the unusual Pokemon Coridon, is that correct? How does she know? I No, I don't have him. Why would you attempt to lie? You appear in any number of clips from security camera footage together with Coridon. I love saying no. I've never been able to do this. And not that I, I do not mean to offend you. In fact, I wish to ask for your assistance. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I'm just going to be mean in this. Coridon, look, it's your, it's your friend. Oh, good to see that you're well. It has been quite a while since we last met. Okay, you like her. Coridon was once in my care, you see. What the frick? Explain some stuff. Its Pokeball was also originally mine. I assumed you received it from a young man called Arvin. I'm no longer in any position to be able to manage that Pokemon myself. What are you, a consciousness trapped somewhere? <laughs> this is what I would ask of you. Will you continue looking after Coridon on my behalf? Okay, I'll say yes. I do appreciate your agreement. How could I say no to that face? I was gonna. Crowdon has been greatly weakened and is currently incapable of battle. It can, however, take on a form specialized for mobility. In all likelihood, it would require some time to fully regain the capabilities it once had. Okay, so it's not just feeding it. I will provide you with my contact information. If you would- Yes, sir! Ma'am, give me your number! Do you have WhatsApp? I will be in regular contact going forward to keep tabs on your status. Damn, already in some secret missions. Until then. Okay, she walked off. No, where did she go? Bruh, they jumping into mysteries right away. Area zero. See, I knew that fog was mysterious. They're acknowledging it. Could this Pokemon have its origins within Area Zero? Sada, don't tell me you actually did it. Did what? Frick, there's... We never have this stuff, man. A freaking... A real mystery, not an obvious mystery. Where you know the answer and then you're just waiting for them to reveal it, you know? Like, they... Well, it seems that the professor is asking quite the favor of you. But of course, the academy is always here to support you in any way that we're able. I do hope you'll continue to enjoy your school life together with that Coridon. Frick, man, I guess everyone knows I have it. Can I, like, see its base stats? I can't even select it. Okay, let me push auto heal. Um, let me see. Hold on, give me a sec. So I'm gonna push auto heal. It won't have any effect. This is what I just prepared this for. Okay, let me at least save my game. Okay, so. Um, what am I even supposed to do? Oh, I I'm free. What the frick? Did you just... Hello, excuse me. Oh, you're still here, Tamo. Oof, getting called into the director's office. How would you land in that much trouble already? Nah, I'm kidding. I know it wasn't like that. Mr. Jack wanted, to show wanted me to show you the way to your room. In the school dorms. Oh, my dorm? Hey, my dorm. Bro, I want to go to this school. Frick. It's, it, the Pokemon world is so dangerous, though. The fact that they let you go on a freaking treasure hunt. Bro, this is blessed. I get a kitchen? What the 
a freak. This is blessers. Ta 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 cha. From today on, this is your room, Tamo. Actually, it's as new to me as it is to you. I've never been in here before. Maybe check out your new bed. Looks comfy. And you must be pretty worn out from all this stuff happening on your first day, huh? A quick rest on the bed is all you need. Okay, that's my joy. That's my nurse joy. We going to bed? Okay, good night. I got a freaking... What is that? Is that a freaking freezer or dishwasher? Is that a safe? What's my fridge? <laughs> Wow, this is cozy. I gotta stop. What do you call these? Stove top? So you have like the mini ver- you have a mini kitchen. This is so good. Oh man, okay. We go to sleep. Um, you need- yeah, new school life. Well, I didn't go to my biology class or any of my classes, but it kind of didn't let me because I missed it. Oh. Oh. Oh my freaking goodness. Many days are going by. And the and at last the day arrives for the treasure hunt. Okay, here comes the speech. Let's listen for evil music. It's somewhere. Wow, so I've been here for at least, I would say, like two weeks. Attention all students. Today marks the beginning of an important new assignment. Please assemble in the schoolyard while I will explain in more detail. Ding dong. Did I freaking put these posters on my wall? Who gave you my key? It's time. You're leaking the, the freaking uh, assembly. I've been waiting forever for this. Come on, let's go to the schoolyard. Dirty staff members know what's up. I have to wait for the assembly and y'all just know. Wow. Was this freaking cloth here and these utensils? I feel like the room changed a bit. Wouldn't that be sick if it did? I think it did. Because there's no way these freaking pens and stuff are here. Can I pee? I want to pee. This leads to the bathroom. Make sure to keep it nice and clean. As opposed to what? Peeing all over the place? Just outright call me out on it. Don't be beating around the bush. Keep it clean. There you go. There's the teachers. Excellent. It seems everyone is here. Well then, it's time I explained your independent study assignment. As usual, the theme will be a treasure hunt. Yeah. I ask each of you to set out and travel the world in search of your own treasure. Look at these teachers. You've all learned much within the walls of our fine academy. Look at that teacher! But now it is time to turn your eyes upon the wider world and deepen your understanding. Explore Paldia's abundant nature, soak in its rich culture. Discover the Pokemon that live here. And get to know the people too. Where will you travel? Who will you meet? And what will you achieve? Of course, your Pokemon partners will be there to help you. What the f You will journey together. Learn new things together. Share each other's thoughts and feelings. And find something you might always treasure. Where is Penny? She didn't show up. She didn't. I look forward to welcoming you all back after your independent study. When you return to us as fine young trainers. There are children here that should not be going. Let the treasure hunt begin. Onward. So, Peony. What's her name? Penny really didn't show up. Did I say Peony before? Who the frick was the Casanova person that called me? Look, Cyclizer! What the frick is the mystery? Toma! Yeah, it's time for the great outdoors! Come on, Cyclizer, we're riding out! The Cyclizer doesn't even drive on its wheel. It, even it doesn't. Take care, everyone. And remember, the great crater bald is exceedingly dangerous. Entering it is a violation of school rules. Sucker, there are Tauros out there that will eat me. What are you waiting for, Tamo? Let's go. That's crazy, bro. Like, they letting these kids... Hey, you guys cannot walk that to... Hey! 
What the frick is this? What the frick? This is like the freaking Instagram reel I saw. I got him. Y'all know it, right? We're like the two people are walking so close. <laughs> no! It's just the freaking or TikTok. I'm sorry, I'll calm down. Um wait, where's that Nomona? We're gonna go everywhere. Okay, my dudes. Well, the treasure hunt has begun. So I push Y. Can I zoom out for a sec? Uh Okay. Please let me zoom out. Oh, here we go. Look at this. I can take on the five uh, titans. I can go like here, Lavincia. Go fight that electric gym leader. I could do all of it. The titans will lead us to the freaking... The weird Pokemon in the center. Look, it's off limits. Cyclists are ru running like that, as you'll see. Has to be confirmation that Koridon is cyclist. Right? So how did it happen? Damo, damo. The treasure hunt is finally starting. What are we supposed to do? Yeah, fair question since it's your first time. Come on, let's walk and talk. What do you put in your bag? You can't even fit like papers. The treasure hunt is a huge part of the Niranya Academy school year. The point isn't to get us all looking for some actual hidden treasure necessarily. We're more just making our own adventures to see what experiences Polly has got to offer. You could try to beat Pokemon gyms. You could help out people in need. You could hunt for real capital T treasure if you wanted even. There's stuff we'd never learned sitting in a classroom, you know? That's true, that's true. Especially if you're learning about Pokemon battling and stuff. Plus, there's so many chances to battle, which is obviously a perfect match for me. Uh, you and me sure got a battle if we run into each other out there. Ooh, that'd be pretty cool. Oh yeah, battling can wait. I meant to tell you. Did you know your phone's map lets you set? Yeah, 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 I know. Okay, I understand. Ch how's that for student council president? Giving your own friends an insider advantage. Are you kidding? What the damn? What is your problem? What is his actual problem? Teaching me how to use my phone. Inside advantage, sheesh, you make it sound like we're cheating or something. All I did was suggest he should check out the gyms. It's up to Thamo where he goes. Thamo's gonna have his hands full searching for Titan Pokemon with me. He doesn't have time to waste on something like chasing after champion rank. Isn't that right, Thamo? Me and him are gonna be too busy visiting the lairs of Titans and nabbing their Herba Mystica. On oh, Serio? Man, I gotta freaking learn Spanish. Oh, serio? Don't go filling his head with weird stories. Hey, all I did was invite him along. It's still up to Tamo whether he goes, right? Grr. Who is this? Hmm, Tamo, your phone's ringing. It's Casanova. I knew it. These are the three things in this game. Gym challenge with Namona. Treasure hunt with this man right here. And this is Team Star. Hey, there. Cassiopeia here. It's about Operation Star. They're freaking listening, you know. Remember what I told you before? Team Star is made up of five individual squads. Five bosses? And each one's got their own base. I need you to go to each base, all five of them, and beat up the squad there. <laughs> Team Star's grunts might try to get in your way, but I'll be helping you out from a distance. And heads up that the bosses each specialize in a different Pokemon type. <laughs> this is definitely a girl. Why have I done this? <laughs> Just remember the names of their crews and you'll figure it out. Wow. So now I'm helping this anonymous person. And I'm also helping Professor Sada. Everyone just wants a piece of me. Still, no need to worry. With your skills, I'm sure you're more than up to the task. I'll just go ahead and add the bases' locations to your phone for you. Yeah, th this is the trio. <laughs> you're like, wait a sec. You Whoa. Who the frick are... Okay. The poison crew and the fighting crew look crazy. The fairy crew is Bede's cousin. The dark crew literally is like... Piers' cousin. Is, that, is he a nurse Joy? Whoa. This is so cool. It's open. You can do whatever you freaking want. Of all three... 
five totem bosses, eight gym leaders, five team star bases. You can do whatever you want. Good luck with those bosses. I'll hook you up with some nice rewards every time you beat one. Wait one second. Who are you supposed to be? And team star, those punks are a serious hazard. They're not Damo's problem. That's right, because he's got more important things to do, like searching out awesome ingredients with me. I thought it was up to Damo to decide whether he goes or not. Wasn't that what you said, Nimona and Arvin? They're listening! I was just thinking to myself, it's obviously not these two. I guess P P P Penny's my closest... My closest guess. So Penny's like shy, but she got a different personality here. It's not Clavo, probably. <laughs> it wouldn't be. Ooh. Okay, a Penny's our guess for now. How do you know my... I'm looking forward to seeing what you can pull off, Damo. Bye. What was that all about? Damo, I'm glad you're making plenty of friends here, but try not to get dragged into anything dangerous. Anyway, no more weird vibes. We've got a big adventure to start. I'm gonna battle every single Pokemon Chandra I meet. If I keep trying to become the strongest, I bet that experience will be the thing I treasure. Guess I'll start by heading to a gym and training up some new Pokemon. She's freaking redoing the gym challenge. She's OP. She's gonna be. Ch I need her to be champion at the end of the story. Well, I mean. Oh, and I know we're running our mouths, but it's what it's your call. What you do, Thamo. Go where you want and do what is what it is you really want to do the most. I don't agree with there. A treasure of our very own. I wasn't saying that. I was mocking Arvin. For me, that's got to be my er my big dream. Of tracking down Herba Mystica. Oh my god, he's researching for his mom. He's shady, man. He's shady. Once we get those herbs, I'll make you the absolute best sandwich you've had in your life. <laughs> of course, for sandwiches. Sandwiches. <laughs> What'd you come up for? Oh my gosh, did you come up because you said sandwich? Ha <laughs> ha. Well, you're not getting one. Bro, this thing is adorable. Why is it freaking wiggle around like that? It seems it wants to start moving. Is it telling you to get on, Thamo? <gasps> yes. Oh my god, I gotta sneeze. Oh my goodness. It's over. Show me everyone's psych lizards. Unbelievable. Whoa, it transforms. Now it really looks like some kind of weird psych lizard. As long as you've got Coridon, you can go pretty much anywhere. Paul the your cloister. Hmm. Yeah, maybe. Well, if you're going to search for those Titan Pokemon, I'd say set up from the East Gate. She's gonna say West. <laughs> but since Thamela's actually headed to take on some gyms, I'd say go for Westgate. Besides, it's way too easy to get lost out East. Man, this is why I can't get along with you. I'm out of here. Catch up soon, little buddy. <laughs> Damn, I love this. Oh, uh, I'll head to a gym. See you around, Thamo. This dialogue, man. This is like in the Legends Arceus category. The treasure hunt has begun, guys. Go on and shank that like button. 5k likes. Did I say 5 or 4? Frick. We'll say 4. 4k likes. We upload this again to the third episode. I can manage it. So shank like, and I'll see you where we'll figure out what we do. Every, so many things. Okay, take care.